What's good? You rocking with your boys are all rights reserved. Shout the commenter nation, comment universe. The topic today is how long is the witness list going to be? Now, before we get into this, let me address something with sources. Shout the commenter nation in the comments when I add you to commenter recognition. Take commenter recognition, which is at currently at 114 videos, minus it from the 225 videos that are now created in the XXX Tentacion. Grab a drink movement has its own playlist. Why is it that I have a source trying to take credit for everything talked about in this? Number one, when you take the 114 minus the 225, what do you get? What do you get? You get about 111, right? Now, out of that 111, I'll even give or take 10 or 15 because I did videos in the midst of me doing information about other things that I had going on in between comment or recognition to add in my own speaking pieces. Why do I have a source that says that I don't give them credit when I give credit to comment or recognition evenly? Now, here's what the problem is. A source does their job. They do what they do. But we did almost 100 videos before I even... When comment or recognition started, go look at the date. I leave my dates on the video. That's when I first met my source. So when I met you there, tell me before then that stuff hasn't come out objectively to what we talked about. So I guess you're responsible for all that, right? Then you have a sloppy, sloppy friend hop up in my comments trying to run her mouth like, give out your real name, your government, give credit to you. How? How are you so much better than the other commenters? How are you so much better than comment or recognition? I guess you're just greater than everyone else. You see, the problem is when other people aren't happy in life or they got struggles, they see his struggles, they take it out on everyone else. How many times did I say that to you? You take it out on everyone else and you expect that to be the fuel to drive the fact, oh, I'm right, I'm right. You tell a person that they're wrong all the time. You never look at the fact you're wrong because you claim you're getting facts. There are times I ask you about direct people that have now come up that you didn't know about. But now you're like, oh, they are there. And then, oh, I knew that something. Like, get out of here. Get out of here. When people aren't happy with themselves. And then all you could do is give me insults. Try and demean my character. But what you don't know, which research you missed, is that I'm from the hate room. The hate room mentality, that's been part of who I am. A legend at that. So what do you really have to add to me? How can you hurt someone who's part of hate when hate's what I come from? Hating on media, player hate, all of that I come from. You can't say or do anything. You want to know what's really sad and pathetic? It's that you guys are grown women and that if I never even started speaking about this, you would have been getting information and never chose to speak about it public. You still know stuff you're not going to tell everybody that you're not speaking about public. And then to top it off, you tell stuff like, oh, no, we can't speak about this. We can't do that. When I first admitted there was a corrupt cop, you tried to lie. You're lying. You told me that's not possible. These are officials. Then it came out there were corrupt cops. Then you're like, oh, I, I said it was up to... Yo, listen to me. Listen to me. Let me say this. If I'm going to be a source with you, you have to be real. Shout to S Money. Let me say something to S Money. Because you've been a source since the beginning, and you told me about the other people that were joining up, hitting me up. Me and you talked about it. You said, look at these people. These people look shaky. You were right about that. I'll give it to you. Matter of fact, in my mind, S Money is now 100% credible, never going to be a wrong source in my mind. Because you called out these people's character, and I didn't see it because I was speaking with them, and they sounded justifiable. But then they get with a friend slide in who never spoke. You never spoke. I would have remembered that picture. You never spoke. But then you want to speak up. Oh, I'll give credit to such as why. And here's what's funny. Are y'all watching now? Are y'all watching now? Why are y'all still watching? Why are y'all still watching then? Here's what it is. The, the source that I had had an issue with me delivering official information of him being deceased. And they did not like the comments not believing them. You sound like controlled media now. How can I control what an adult thinks? How can I tell people in comments, you better believe this. You better. I don't have that right. Objectively, that would be against the whole methodology I use. You're not making me go against myself. Look, I'm not your whipping boy. And I'm not no man you're going to slide along like say what I said. I'm not that man. If that's the man you want, 
Good luck. But that I'm not that type of man. So you're not going to say things to me and I'm going to do as you say, not as you think. Like, you need to back out. <laughs> you need to back out. Unsubscribe then. I don't need you. The same way you don't need to be doing this, I don't need you. You got it messed up. You got your ego around, oh, I know this exact information. When you don't even know, some of the people you're talking to on the phone are talking to me under different names. And here's what's so lame about them. When they unsubscribe or if they get blocked, they make a new username just to watch. That's how lame you are. That's how lame you are. Because you got to. You're like, I hate this guy, but I got to see what he's talking about. Like, keep it moving. That's what I want. That's what I want. So that's what I'm saying. If you don't want to be here, don't be here. If you want to hate other people for what they feel, leave. We don't need you. And I don't care if you know how he died, when he died, at what time, the exact time. We're objective. Yo, listen. I don't care what you know. If you're a snake... Or you don't defend the person you're being a source for. You do not need to be talking to them. Just because your sloppy friend wants to hop on, run her mouth, and talk about stuff. And just because you need a friend, you want to make this person credible, has nothing to do with me. That has nothing, never did. I'm different. I move different. Always have. My media shows for a hundred videos almost before you even surface. You were ghost then. And I was still on point with my thoughts. That's how lame you... Like, you really need to keep it moving. Then I did comment the recognition, and you want to take credit for it? Like, no one else was speaking. See, I turned a YouTube, keyword you, which means me, into a group speak on subject. What no one ever did. Period. You Were you responsible for that? But no, you enjoy them comments, don't you? That's how lame people are. And here's what my thing is. And I don't want to feel this way. That's why it's hard to interact with women in a business setting or in a business manner because their emotions cloud their thought. They don't see how dumb they are for just accepting what someone else says when they're questionable. I will say this. Thomas Lyde might have been right. He might have been right speaking about Ari and other things. If that's the type of people you want to say is saying, oh, he's not credible about this. When you were giving me most of the information, that's silly. That's silly. Ari didn't know about me when I started the series. You didn't know about me. A lot of other people didn't know about me. There are key people in Commenter Nation that was always here. And it's none of you. None. So what are you talking about? You're just talking. And here's my thing. These same lames are just going to find a way back on the channel to click dislike. That's fine. But Commenter Nation is going to rock out. Because I know for a fact... There's stuff you're not saying. There's stuff you're not saying. Don't you feel like a fake? Because you're finding out information for yourself that can really give people comfort. But you don't want to step up and say it yourself? Where were y'all channels? Why didn't y'all step up and do it? Why? Here's the funny thing. I speak about any other subject. You don't have, you don't have nothing to say because you don't know about it. And you could say, oh, no, because I don't care. How do you have your time freedom, but you still find, how are you upset with life? If you have time freedom to do your own business, to be your own business person, make your own living, how are you upset with life? I can tell you already, I have a loving woman. I have good people around me. I interact with great people. I interact with credible people. People don't have to question my credibility. I grew up with me because they know my character. What do you have to show for it? But friends who can't speak in comments, who just pop up when they feel like they need to pop up, who have nothing credible to themselves, even to speak in comments, just talking out the side of their neck. Like, you want me to say her government name? Are you dumb? She didn't even ask for that. So I guess mentioning the word clout has nothing to do with y'all, right? Because you want me to mention your real name, and then you discredit it. Every other person that has had a thought that I've spoken on and given them credit. Listen. That's why I did comment or recognition. Because I knew for a fact, for a fact, someone was going to act like this. And they showed their true colors, that's all. That's all, I got nothing else to say. So, go ahead and leave if you want. How long is this witness list? How long? How long? How many people are going to be on it at the end? From what I seen last time that this source showed me it, it was a lot of people. 
And that's the thing. There's stuff you guys don't know because they're not going to step up and say it. Someone else isn't going to step up and say it. So I chose to be the one to step up and say it since the beginning. Even questioning it when people were getting mad. But you guys hide yourself and then y'all speak from behind the scenes. And then you yell, give me my credit. Get out of here. Get out of here. Comment the recognition is your credit with your name tag. What are you talking about? And that's not clout? What are you talking about? How many videos did I have? Go back and look at the dates. How long have you actually been in tune with the channel? Then you don't even watch the whole videos. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. You can't, you can't criticize if you don't know the form. You didn't watch the whole form. You didn't watch the many different facades. So you can't even criticize it. You didn't watch the skill. You're not even in tune with the way things work. So what are you speaking on? That's called talking out your neck. Because you don't know what you're talking about. You're talking out the side of your head by some sloppy woman hopping in comments, talking out the side of her head. Oh, I got it. Let me tell y'all something. There are some people who do want to see justice. How since the beginning have spoken about it when people were like, why are you speaking about it? Don't talk about it. When another YouTuber asked me why I'm speaking about it. Are you serious? And then... You want to slide over to your girls on the phone, gossip, child, child, I heard, child, that's all y'all do. So stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. What are you talking about? What are you talking, what are you talking about? Because that's crazy. I never would have treated someone's demise like that. Child, that's what I heard. Child, you found out such and such happened. Oh, child, did you know such, child. Child, child, what are you doing it for? What are you doing it for? Because you're making personal calls to these people. You have no clue could be speaking to me through another name you don't even know about. What are you talking about? Yo, what's crazy to me is that it turned out to be your type of person. That you, the credible person that has all this information turned out to be a snake in the grass. That had someone faking and flogging and saying whatever they wanted about me. And then you're like yelling at me because of it. Just because you're not happy with something. Because you don't get your way. And let me mind you, controlling a real man is not easy. Let me mind you. But supporting him makes him want to be around you. Because he realizes you're sincere if you didn't know that. I can only get the instinct of your character. I can only take it verbatim from what you say and do. And I've always kept it authentic on here. Even when I was responding to people around me who were acting funny. Responding to people who were trying to interrupt the series. I kept it authentic the entire time. Who knows what you're doing behind closed doors. I hope you're not entertaining yourself with that sloppy friend. I just hope you're not entertaining yourself. Because that would make a lot of sense. You're defensive for nothing. Coming at me for nothing. Because... You don't like the situation the way things are going somewhere else. But instead of addressing it there, you got to come to me complaining, whining, uh, convicting me of things that aren't even in my realm. That I have no... How do I control what a commenter thinks? How do I control what they believe? That's why you guys are controlled media. Whether or not I know facts, I'm going to tell you this. The same way I started this series grinding and you thought to reach out. There's going to be somebody else I get in touch with. There's other people. Matter of fact, there's other people I'm already in touch with. That know stuff I know me and you never talked about. See, you take it from the investigative side. I can get it from the other side. Because those are the type of people that have reached out. Those are the type of people that I speak to that you never met. And just because you want to hide the info and lay low on it. And then try and say, oh, we can't talk about it. Watch how I bring it out. Then you're telling me, watch, you'll see the truth, you see the truth. Good, I will, and we'll fight for it. Because I'm no longer getting in touch and linking up with lames that think like that. That's sad. You're a grown woman with that, and it's sad. We good over here. Who else said that? Who else said that? That was the same guy who was talking stuff like, oh, be humble, flashing a bag of money in a car. Y'all all the same. Y'all show yourself. Y'all all the same. We good over here. Good. Stay good over there, and remember, when this subject changes, you have nothing to add. Nothing. 
your mentality ends here because that's where your skill ends my skill set is vast i've shown it i've been on credible youtubers channels doing it i've learned from greats are you are you dumb Clint queen's flip queen's flip voice are you dumb are you dumb are you dumb no really are you dumb are you really are you really a natural whipping boy a man whose life started losing his mother how are you going to talk to me what can you tell me started losing the greatest woman in the world i can ever have how are you going to talk to me you know what it's like do you know what that's like you don't you have no clue so you can't talk to me just like I'm your little son. Like, oh, yeah, that, that, yeah, that, you got ego, whatever. When you're the one with ego and you're the one talking out your butt, you already know what it is. You know how I rock. All right, preserved.